on out. I'm on a very low income because I'm a carer for my daughter. So I, I don't, people say you get a lot of money. You don't. You get enough to live on just about. I don't have surplus money to buy an extra six weeks worth of meals twice a day. Today it was chicken, veg and what was it? Pasta. After every school holiday, I'd be ill because I'd be that worn out. So instead of going from like doing one meal a day and having to do three, it's really difficult to budget for that on a low income. Like I know if something's wrong, I can go to Tim or to Nick or to Claire or anyone in that church environment and talk to them. Because Lunch Club is so cool. I feel very happy because I'll be bouncing off the walls. I'm joined by Sam Craven, who leads the work of TLG Make Lunch, which involves helping churches to provide free meals to children and families during the school holidays. Sam, thank you very much for joining me today. Um, at TLG Make Lunch, obviously, we've been unable to run um, our usual holiday programs and um, where people come together and eat together and do fun activities together and um, that's not been possible in lockdown but we've been urging and encouraging and equipping all of our clubs across the country and um, to engage with emergency care parcels which we've called boxes of hope um, and um, churches have been filling these parcels with food, um, with, uh, with messages of hope and with opportunities to connect in with the community remotely obviously um, but just to address that isolation and loneliness as well as the hunger um, that's potentially arriving due to the increases in poverty. Drop the parcel at the door and obviously stand back and maintain the distance but just let them know that someone's thinking about them, find it wherever we can in this lockdown. We would love um, churches to get involved and um, to come and join in with the Boxes of Hope programme. Sam, thank you very much for speaking to me today.